Hi and welcome back to Scotty's Tech.info. I'm Scotty with my co-host Cletus. So I made a video earlier about how to calibrate your screen color. If you do art, if you do web design, you want the colors on your screen to be super awesome. Uh, you can watch that video or check the description for the link to that one. Uh, but this one is, okay, once you got your screen colors calibrated nicely, what happens when you print something in color, obviously, and, you know, blue looks like green and like magenta looks like pink or red, red looks like pink, all the colors are all screwed up. What the heck do you do? Well, you can get super fancy and you can get like a specific uh, printer with like super calibrated inks and like specific color profiles and all this other nonsense. But most of us just have like a regular color inkjet printer and we just want to do some quick and dirty printouts and we want it to look like the colors on our screen. So what do you do? Well, there's a really simple trick and it'll take you about 30 seconds to do. So what we're gonna do to fix this is we're gonna click the start button and type color management and you want the color management control panel. Uh, now what you're gonna have to do here in the device, you use the pull down menu and you say, okay, I want the color printer. So say like, all right, here, it's the Canon color printer, right? Uh, then you're going to click use my settings for this device. And then for the profile selection, normally it just selects it automatically. You want manual. And then you come down here. There's obviously no profiles. So you click add to add a profile. And the one you're going to want to pick is this one right here. It's a generic color profile, sRGB IEC 61966-2.1. SRGB color space profile. This is like if you calibrate your screen, you're going to be kind of, you know, using the, the it, it, it sort of calibrates it and usually tells you like if you use a spider uh, calibrator, it'll say like, oh, your screen is now like 98% of the sRGB color space. Uh, so that's why you pick this one. You click OK. And right, that's pretty much it. If you have any other color printers, you repeat that process and then you click close. Right, so that's about it. Uh, try your printout again, and you will most likely notice that the colors are far more accurate. Pink is pink, red is red, blue is blue, green is green, and so on. Now, this is not 100% uh, effective, but in most cases, right. If you have a calibrated screen, you're like, you know, 98, 99, 100% of sRGB. You use the sRGB color profile for your printouts, and boom. Uh, for most people, this is going to give you accurate enough color for the kind of stuff that you want to print. For more techie tips, see scottystech.info. Thanks for watching. See you next time.